Hit his area with 51. Everything in the butterflies. Go get your man. And I feel like butterfly gonna recap this. So all oh, y'all wanna know what happened. I'm gonna tell you what happened. He got smoked. Hey, ain't no deadline on revenge. Bitch, I'm a beater. Yo, the last man standing. Hey, we can go body for body. Yeah. Yo, 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 Hey man, I can't complain too much, man. You already know it's this weekend battle rap, but it's your boy Showtime SP, the nobody that knows bodies. No, 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 no. Nah, what up, though? Nah, man. You know I got my shades on because the future is bright right now. You know what I'm saying? So I was trying to look. I was looking at all these cars and seeing everything that was going on. And battle rap has been like blinding me. You know what I'm saying? But uh, I'm with it. Yo, it's a lot of things going on. It's a lot of it's a lot of events going on. It's a lot of things to talk about. Yeah. Uh, you know, first and foremost. Rest in peace to Pat Stay again. I know we say it, people say it, but I was thinking, you know, I was like, um, I had put out a tweet that said his presence and his uh, spirit will never be forgotten. A lot of people reacting. It was just saying it to say it, but I was thinking, imagine if he was on one of these cards. You know what I'm saying? Like, any one of them. It doesn't even matter the league, you know what I'm saying? So He would be on them. You, I, I said, sure. I'm, but you know, my my selfish thought was mm -hmm. imagining that, but I didn't say that, you know what I'm saying? Like, well, you not here? You worry about the tweet? So I just said, rest in peace, past day. But my mind was fixated on okay. imagine if he was here. Um, speaking of what is here, mm -hmm. uh, so many things we can we can we can start with. Uh, obviously, Tay Rock and Av main event of Summer Madness. Mm -hmm. um, their face off just released today on the URL app. Mm -hmm. um, John John Don's got a bullpen event. The Mecca that just um, streamed on Caffeine. It was later than the end of slavery, so I didn't see anything. I'm not even gonna see it in front like I saw some. I didn't see nothing. You know, I didn't see nothing because number one, the fight was last night. We'll talk about the fight too. Definitely you know what I'm saying? Uh, we'll talk, talk about it. Roll up! <laughs> we got we, we got a second here. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? We got some yeah. things we need to speak about. We got a couple things we need to break down. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, so uh John John had the Mecca event yesterday, you know what I'm saying? Right. I'm seeing a lot of good reaction to it online. Uh, I've seen uh, some people talk. Mm -hmm. Let's talk Battle Rap B1, trusted source, and a couple other trusted sources that tell me he beat Jay Mills. But I heard Jay Mills is way better than he's been before. I've been hearing but that. But I'm going to reserve judgment, you know what I'm saying? Because I will watch it and I will speak on it accordingly. But salute to him. His event is on caffeine. Mm -hmm. Did you? You didn't see it, did you? Man, I didn't get a chance to do nothing. It was park day for the kids. All right. <laughs> cool, 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 cool. But uh, <clears throat> yeah, so salute to him, you know what I'm saying? I seen that he got the uh, mm -hmm. a letter from the city of Yonkers. Salute yep, to Yonkers. Yonkers. Salute to everybody in New York, you know what I'm saying? Hold on. You know, they be doing all this Philly shit with battle rap all year. I ain't trying to fuck all that. New York, shout out to Yonkers. You know what I'm saying? If it was up there, I hope it was good. Shout out to Nah. Shout out to Philly too. But uh, we gotta uh, talk about Av versus uh, Tay Rock. Obviously, the face off just came out. But I wanted your perspective. You know what I'm saying? He had a live stream. You know what I'm saying? Where he was talking about a live the other day. Who yeah, he okay. was on okay. live, and it's, it's all over. Uh, Battle yeah. rap track. There's other yeah. motherfuckers. You can just go, you go online and find the shit. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Um, and he was going live, and he was talking about a lot of things, and he was saying that he wants to battle like at the beginning of the night or something like that. Let me be hold. Let me go, Doc. I know you about to jump. Let me finish. <laughs> he wants to battle at like the beginning of the night. Because mm. uh, <laughs> so, this is a walking. You gotta be. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. this is, I'm not gonna. I, he wants to battle at the beginning of the night. Mm -hmm. He don't really give a fuck about the headline, be a headline of Summer Madness. He said the only thing, you know, it could equal some more money and things like that. And I've seen Chris Bias had touched on some of this earlier, but you know, who would I be to not say what I see? So he's basically saying that he doesn't want to, he doesn't care about being main event. He would rather battle first or second on the card. Mm -hmm. And that, you know, there's just like a lot of hype and hoopla around being, let me tell you something, Av, and, and I rock with Av too. Mm -hmm. The main event of Summer Madness don't battle first and second of the night. Like that. The nerve of you. <laughs> but you That's know, like disrespect. That's that ain't the way that the money's set up. That ain't the way that the situation is set up. That ain't the way that the promoting, the, promoting, the marketing, anything that has to do with the Summer Madness event does not surround the main event battling first. So hold on, here's another one, right? Mm -hmm. So I say that to say this, you know what I'm saying? Because 
Rock has been on Summer Madness before. Yeah, multiple times. A lot of them. Yeah. <laughs> and when he's headlining, he's headlining. Last. You know what I'm saying? Dead last or right before last, mm -hmm. right? So that's number one, right? Mm -hmm. Adam's been on Summer Madness, I think, once. Uh, it was verse, uh, I forgot who it was. He had T-Top. Was T-Top? Yeah, I think it was T-Top. He had Summer Madness on one song. Yeah, because I thought it was Shotgun Show, but Shotgun Show was known. No. He had T-Top on Summer Madness, right? Mm -hmm. So. He also, now if I'm not mistaken, that was Math too? He better There wasn't on Summer Madness. Was that Summer Madness though? I don't mm -hmm. think so. Nah, not that shit. Now you okay. talking about that shit, I, I don't mm -hmm. even remember. That was the worst Summer Madness. That's what, what I'm saying. Call, I, that I remember Adam being on another hold Summer up, Madness. Hold, hold. So they were saying that he was on another Summer Madness. I think mm -hmm. he was on that one. Even mm -hmm. if he was on more than one, the other one probably was not remember what. He did He did battle with Math on that shit. Yep. That shit was horrible mm -hmm. though. Oh my. Yeah, Math oh. was on that shit was that. horrible. That I'm shit was so bad. I didn't even remember that was summer madness. Why you need me? That, why no, you know that, that shit. Was, <laughs> that shit might have been summer madness. I remember that now. Yes. But shout out to Ab. You know what I'm saying? So here's a, here's one of my point is right. Mm -hmm. uh, when you get in a position to be on summer madness, especially if you're the main event, there's only like less than freaking. 1% of anyone who will ever say they could be in the main event of Summer Madness in their life, right? Mm -hmm. um, there's another battle or two that I've been hearing rumored. If one of them is what we think it is, yeah. you know what I'm saying? I've been hearing Rex is supposed to battle Geechee Gotti. I don't really care. If he if that battle happens on the card, then you know we could debate on what's the main event. But right. what I'm saying is this. Uh, Ab, you're supposed to be, you gotta look at the opportunity. You got Rock in your in your, in your your rear view. Mm -hmm. uh, you've been wanting to battle Rock for a couple years now, I'm pretty sure. You got him, you got him as main event on Summer Madness. Don't wanna be fifth. Don't wanna be first. Don't want, you, dog, you got to, you might have to go last, man. Might. If Surf is on Summer Madness, might. he's not going first. You know what I'm saying? Like, if Lux is on Summer Madness, he's not going first. If Geechee Gotti's on Summer Madness, the main event, he's not going first. You mm -hmm. see what I'm saying? Or second. I know that after you, uh, did you find a fucking card yet, man? You out your motherfucking mind. I've been, I've been, oh, okay. yeah, it, was, it, was six, it was six or seven. It was six oh, and seven. Okay. He was oh. Summer Madness six, Summer Madness seven, and I think everyone after that he was not on. He was on the gnomes. Okay. Uh, so, 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 I say this to say this. What do you think about his approach? Does it mean anything? Or do you actually care about this? I mean, like at the end of the day, this is all just speed. I don't but, care what he does, but I'm just saying it because it was sick. It's funny when you say, do I care? Because of course I care. I think that this battle is going to be one of the biggest battles of the year. But I need to feel like it's one of the biggest battles of the year. Yes, we both know that both of them are going to be bar heavy. We know that they're going to come with completed homework. Let's not worry about the buildup. We already know that the test is going to be hard. It's going to be a great test right. for on both sides, right? Because needless to say, it's going to be bars. It's just the fact that Av what we're looking from Av is something that we've never gotten from Av. And that's promotion. And that's literally hyping up his his his... Ab doesn't even physically have grudge matches. There was only a there, if there's one or two that I can honestly think of as a grudge match. It was Big K and Aver. Those are and the only two. One of them. You see what I'm saying? So it's not like so. It ain't either. Every other battle Ab has had is and and you know the Ab and you know I ain't I, this is no disrespect. I'm not disrespecting on, nobody on this table. I'm just keeping it funky. Man, when go. it comes when it comes to Ab, we know okay if it's so and so versus Ab, all right that person better bring their A game. Otherwise Ab going bar bar him to death. But you never seen a build up versus Ab versus Blue Easy. You never seen a build up with Ab versus Rada. You never see a build up when it's Ab and uh, uh, Chess when it's Ab and I can go. That was a all, surprise by us. Uh, so respect. But, but I'm saying. What is this? Too. But I'm just saying, when it comes to Ab, it's not about the buildup. We know that Ab is going to produce the product. So what we're so as fans, I guess what we're asking for is, hey, act like you care. Mm -hmm. And it's it's evident that Ab kind of has that persona that he don't necessarily care about all of the other pop and circumstance. He would be quote unquote considered a real nigga because I ain't for all of this. The only thing I want to do is show up, cook your ass, and then go home. It makes sense, right? Now, on the other side too, well why ain't Tay Rock building up the battle? Why how come Tay Rock ain't getting none of the slack? Cause it's Tay Rock. Tay Rock doesn't have to. Literally, if you poke the bear, he will definitely attack you. So if if, if Ab goes any way of a route of trying to be disrespectful towards Tay Rock, Tay Rock is going to take it there. And he's gonna go past all of that. That's what we know. So it's best best that it's this type of situation. You know what I'm saying? Cause I just don't wanna I don't want to mess up the battle itself with all of the extra bullshit for the building. That's just my take. That's just my take. It's a bad take. <laughs> I mean, it's your take, but it's a bad take. I'm going to be honest. Because honestly, it's like this, right? Uh, we, and this is not, you know what I'm saying, this is not in a, in a negative connotation. It's mm -hmm. like this. 
this summer madness we all know it's not really no huge build up you know what i'm saying like it's cool I, I, there's some battles on the car i like the battles on the car i'm gonna watch them yeah uh i said scale of one to ten six and a half maybe seven you know yeah. what i'm saying that's where i was at with it yeah. and i'm cool with it and that's that that's just my personal opinion who, who am i nobody mm -hmm. so check this out mm -hmm. um I think like when you have the main event, like even with JC versus Sue Surf last year, mm -hmm. JC's not a promoter. JC's not really the type of guy that's gonna be out there being vocal and yada yada yada. As Chris mm -hmm. said earlier, we see his manager more than we see him nowadays. You see what I'm saying? So you ain't gonna hear or see much from him. He's not gonna promote, he's not gonna do all of the in intricate things when it comes to battle rap. But at least last year we was kinda like hyped to see it. You know what I'm saying? Like we some of us even well not some of us, now, you know? <laughs> ain't too many of us. A few of us, mm -hmm. maybe every now and then of us, mm -hmm. thought that he actually had a chance to be Sue Sir. I mean, I, I remember the face off. Mm -hmm. I recall, you know, that build up from, from then on. I was like, oh, Sir JC actually might have something for Sir. Mm -hmm. I was there. Mm -hmm. And he ain't had nothing. He, he just, he, he even told me the night before what he was going to do. And I was like, don't do that. And he did it anyway. Mm -hmm. So, with that being said, even if it's about a build up, or anything. Now, I, like I said, I'm I'm with everybody saying that it doesn't feel like a build up to this battle. It doesn't feel like it's a a main event, and it it kind of does feel like that. And I'm I'm not mad at it because we're looking at two workers who we know is going to work. Like it, that's just how I, I just see that battle. Now, granted, it is the uh, I don't I disagree with the whole you know let's go first, let's let's get you know third, second, or third. That's not happening. That that's that's ridiculous. Absolutely not. Now. What I would prefer is to add to actually act like he is a top tier. Act like you are the main event. I need you to act like it. I know you have the persona of the, hey man, I'm real, you know what I'm saying? Dap me up, shake my hand, firm grip, all that stuff. That's cool. Mm -hmm. But you kind of got to take what your opponent is already having is that aura of, I know I'm shit. Right. I can go anywhere and cook. I've just doesn't have that right, right, Alright, so here's the deal, right? <laughs> so, I'm not the biggest of wrestling fans in the world, right? Mm -hmm. But, I know enough, right? Yeah. So, when you had guys like Stone Cold Steve Austin, mm -hmm. The Rock, you know what I'm saying? These are like the main guys, right? Mm -hmm. And there's others too, right? You didn't have a guy like X-Pac carrying himself like he was The Rock, you know what I'm saying? Or carrying himself like he was Stone Cold Steve Austin. He was a middle of the car guy, he got in, he did his job, did a good job of it, entertained it, went home. I'm proud of If you. that's what, you know what I'm saying? I'm, 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 I'm in a motherfucker, right? Okay. So, if that's what you want to be, like a middle of the car guy, mm -hmm. then you can't take Rock money, you know what I'm saying? Like, why get The Rock, why get Stone Cold Steve Austin top of it? Because the thing is, once you headline a card, mm -hmm. your life changes. I'm talking mm -hmm. about headlining Summer Madness. Yeah. Your bracket. Yeah. What top, what, what mid-tiers ever headline a Summer Madness? Exactly, you, do, do mid-tiers headline Summer Madness? No, right? JC. You fucking make Summer Madness, right? JC is the JC's closest. JC's the top tier. No, I'm not, no, no, I'm saying, but at that time, like, he was, But what I'm yeah. saying is mid-tiers don't host, don't, don't, it's don't very top impossible. Summer Madness. It's impossible. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's impossible. damn near impossible, mm -hmm. right? So what I'm saying is, mm -hmm. he's worked and worked and worked for years and years and years to where people say, you know, they're like, oh man, you know what he's gonna do, he's gonna come, he's gonna punch line, he's gonna leave, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. But at the end of the day, you are trying to overthrow the face the, of the brand right now. Sue Surf is not here, free Sue Surf, mm -hmm. unfortunately, but Rock is the second in command. If mm -hmm. Sue Surf is the Dwayne Wade or LeBron James mm -hmm. of freaking, uh, of, the, of, of URL, mm -hmm. Tay Rock had a spot on the roster too. Yeah. He was Dwayne Wade. He was Chris. Whoever, he was a supporting partner yeah. in making this thing go. Mm -hmm. So when one leaves, the other automatically assumes a position of power. Up. And the yeah. thing is, a lot of people are saying, um, "Why isn't Tay Rock doing blah, blah blah blah?" He has an event coming up next week. Mm. He has real deal next week. You see what I'm saying? Mm. Like he literally has real deal on his own card. So he's running the card, running the pay per view. Got mm -hmm. a whole bunch of artists booked. People coming in, mm -hmm. and he's trying his hand at league owner now. Mm -hmm. A lot of the cats are doing the league mm -hmm. owner thing. Because that's the quickest way to get on YouTube. If you are a league owner, your content releases where? YouTube. On YouTube. You know what I'm saying? Now, I could see situations where, you know, they might have a battle first, then it's like John John's card, it'll end up on caffeine, mm. probably end up on the app, and yeah. then end up on YouTube. Mm. But it'll get there eventually. eventually. People would rather have a pipeline to get to YouTube Directly. than no person, no possibility whatsoever. Right. That's just a thing that I see. Okay. But overall, I'm not taking nothing away from Ad versus Rock. I do think they're conventionally unconventional mm -hmm. when it comes to the promotion because, like you said, it's leading to a battle. Maybe the face-off will uh, give us a little bit more, but so far it's just... I'm hearing it's not the same. 
I'm all right, well, I'm hearing that. What like, you here, man? It's no build, like I'm saying, it's no build up. Like the, it is the what we want is a build up. Mm-hmm. I, I'm also optimistic because I kind of want to be like, let's not. Typically, face offs be worse than the battles, right? Mm-hmm. I mean, sorry, no. Typically, face offs be better than some of the battles, especially when it comes to certain face offs. The battle be better. The battle be whack, and the face off was the most important part. Mm-hmm. For example, DNA and Bill Collector. I will always remember that face off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But the battle itself was just cool. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? So it's like, I, I, I'm, I'm not, I just don't want to, I really don't want to poke the bear in this situation because I just don't want it to, to go left. And and I know Abs is saying that he don't want it to go personal and stuff like that. I'm like, it's just, you 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 definitely giving me feelings that you don't care. Like, you don't but, care. But shout out to Ab, shout out to Rock, you know what I'm saying? It is what it is. I'm sure that uh, this, this could be one of those situations where the face-off and the build-up to the battle might not be good and the battle actually be good. Like I said, Ab had a battle versus Chess that wasn't announced, mm-hmm. that had no pro- promotion, no publicity, but this was back on Known mm-hmm. when Ab was first coming up through the league and he had one of the better battles of the night, you know what I'm saying? I come out the, I'll clap that fuck, come out the cave with the tray, I feel like Batman, Batman probably, you know what I'm saying? Like, he had some of the lines. Uh, fucking the, the uh, mm-hmm. I swing it, uh, mm-hmm. yeah. you know, bitch in my crew. If Tago, I'm hitting you too. Mm-hmm. All you gonna see is that arm swinging over rock like I'm skipping yeah. to my loop. You yep. know what I'm saying? Like he had all of them shits in there too. He had a lot. You know what I'm saying? Like he had a lot. That that fucking that day. He had that treasure chest, the chest line. He yo, he was wilding on chest. That was a good battle. But I will say this, Av is more a, pro- a performance. You know yes. what I'm saying? He's more. I'm gonna bring it to the performance than to the promotion. You know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? And you know sometimes promotion. Is good as long as the performance is good. I've seen great promotion with horrible performances. Promotion <laughs> and performance have to match together. So I'm gonna write both of those down. Um, I, I now you got a, uh, you in another situation like I, I want to move off the AB situation. You Salute to them and everything that's going on with them. Facts. Uh, <clears throat> quite obviously, there was uh, a lot of people talking about Danny Myers and Swamp, who's not on the card so far. Mm-hmm. Uh, I'm pre- I'm damn near as sure as I'm sure of my name that. Uh, one of them probably might wind up on the car, but it's not Danny. So Danny um, mm. takes took some shots at Loaded Lux this week. I know you heard the uh, the freestyle yeah. that he did. I mean, we, we spoke yeah. about it earlier in the mm. week. Uh, and there might have been some little bit of materialization. Like, people talking like Lux may actually come down in battle, like, in this era. Not at, like, the top of the top of the card. Not having to be on no fucking homecoming or big stage, just, like, on a regular card. How would you feel about it if that was to happen? I would, that, that sounds like... Uh, it's catering to a legend. Like uh, usually, when a legend asks for something, URL or the league will basically cater to it. Mm-hmm. Mook made sure that there was nobody in that room but him and Rock. Mm-hmm. Same thing with Lux. If Lux is saying that, hey, that room is, is a better fit for me, give it to him. Cause he, I mean, you get we put it, we put Lux out there on the limb. You know, big stage, and everybody was against him. Okay, well now bring him back home to where in the essence that it is. I'm not mad at that decision. No, Look, closed room Lux. Is one of the spookiest looks that I've ever seen. Uh, I would like to see. I mean, if I, I mean, obviously, you know, it's their money, their company, do what they want. Mm-hmm. But if you want to sell the app, you have Loaded Lux battle Danny Myers on a volume and put it on the app without nobody seeing it. Yep. You want to sell the app. You want people to buy the app. I guarantee you they'll do it then. Mm-hmm. I guarantee you that. Sure. I guarantee you, a motherfucker, they know what they had coming. It was like, man, Loaded Lux versus Danny's on the app. The only way I can see it is if I buy the app. That's what the f- you're supposed mm-hmm. to be doing. Hey, but. <laughs> you know that is, is I would buy it. Yeah. I definitely would get it. I'd but, um, spend eight dollars just to watch that. <laughs> but that's that's just a, a thought. Uh, one of the thoughts. But when it comes to him and Swamp, mm-hmm. uh, both MCs came off the trenches card. Uh, Real deal stayed on the trench. Well, he battled on the on trenches the trench. card. And he battled on URL the next damn sure card. Did. Sure did. So uh, it comes back to the old preface: if you're cooking, they, they book him. You're gonna get booked. Like mm-hmm. they, you can put whatever in my face. You can threaten me however you want. You can give me all of these ultimatums. But at the end of the day. If you cooking, stay booked. That's facts. You want to stay booked. Um, as far as Danny goes, I would have liked to see him or Swamp on Summer Madness, but I'm gonna do this. If you got a choice, one or the other, because obviously both ain't going. Who's going? If it's Danny or Swamp. Yeah. And they're not battling each other, so either I think they already did this. I'd go with Swamp. Right. I, I'd go. I go with Swamp only because of the oversaturation and Danny's schedule. Like his his, his schedule would be the worst. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. I'd rather I see less of Danny just so when I do get to see him, it's some heat. Mm-hmm. So that's the kind of the campaign that I'm on. I would definitely go with Swamp. And I would have went with Swamp and Chef Trez, but I don't think Chef Trez is going to do that battle because he was saying he won. I, I don't know. Like, I, I don't want to put this on yeah. him. 
But I heard through what I heard, like through the grapevine scene online, that he wanted to like headline. Whoa, hey, hey, whoa, ho, ho, hold on, my nigga. Hold on, you've been having a great year. You're having a headline summer man this year, my nigga. Well, yeah, I, yeah. I wouldn't say headline summer man. You're having a but, great year, though. You're having to be on the card. He's definitely having to be on the card. Facts. <laughs> yeah. But he can headline in the South. But just not summer madness. It could be oh, yeah, in, yeah, 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 yeah. in the South, yeah. yeah. Swan versus Chef Trash, that, right, that would be fine. That's a man of man. it for bullpen. You know what I'm saying? If it was like that. Swan not going over there. I'm just I'm, easy, I'm, easy. I'm 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 saying what it is. I'm just saying <laughs> yeah. how it would make sense for it to be a made of it. I, I didn't say how. <laughs> I just said this is what would make um, sense. <laughs> but yeah, I would like to see him on there. Uh Swamp, he can battle Trez. Uh, Luke Castro was another name that was being thrown around That's in the nation. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Um, and then I heard names like Ace Amin and uh, and Rum uh, Ace Amin and Rum Nitty battling against each other. But I don't know if that's going to actually happen because I've been hearing a lot of people like you see the names, right? Yep. You see the names up top, but I've been hearing a lot of people like below it, like like people in the comments and people that have been speaking behind the scenes, like mm. they just they like it's all right. Yeah. They don't feel like it's a summer man at all. So here's the deal, right? Um, but I do. If you ask me, I I don't have. I would not have had a problem if I would have seen that that battle on the car. Neutral. But I'm neutral. It is what it is. Uh, I, it's like one of the things where if I don't see it, I'm not tripping. If I saw it, I would have been good with it. Right. Too. Um, <laughs> you got a uh, rare breed entertainment. They announced Show Off versus Head Ice today. Mm. Uh, mm. I like the battle. Mm -hmm. um, I'll just lead it and I'll throw it to you and tell me what you think. Mm -hmm. um, I like head ice, you know, you, <laughs> it's me. <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. It's disrespectful, you know what I'm saying? Like, I got to be like, where you get all those damn clips from, man? I keep ice, man. Like, man, it's trucking shows, man. Yeah. Put, do the Mayweather one. Do the we Mayweather. just, see, we do just the seen <laughs> with the mustard yeah, on yeah, that shirt. Yeah, I got a hundred on it if I got <laughs> like, one. Uh, and the reason being is, you know, I, I fuck with head ice from mm -hmm. like the Lions Den days, you know what I'm saying? My, um, we said, uh, <laughs> my favorite three words is hands up. <laughs> Put your hands, you know what I'm saying? Like, uh, but uh, I really, I, I, I like this battle because Head Ice and Show Off was supposed to battle in social distance. Social distance, Head Ice got like a 55 minute round off. Show Off said, hell no, I'm not doing it. So it literally looked like Show Off versus Head Ice, but only show, only Head Ice wrapped his round because it was recorded. It was okay, all right. Remember that shit? I was like, like yo, I his remember. His round was like 20 minutes yeah, long. Yeah, all right. And Show Off did not submit a round because yeah. it was like, yo, this nigga tried to line me. You know what I'm saying? I was only going to do the standard five minute joint. Yeah. His round is 25 minutes. He didn't do it. So they got some stain between them. You know what I'm saying? Um, I see people saying, oh, you know, oh, man, this ain't the super, super, super max out battle like the rest of the Shut four. up. Shut, this you got is four other back. Relax. I Relax. I, 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 I wanted a battle that was going to drop without <laughs> me knowing. He didn't, I didn't know. I, we knew about the rest of them, so the, yeah. the, the blogs were done. Yeah. I didn't know about this one. It came out random. I knew the battle was happening, yeah. but I didn't know when it, when it was drop. dropping. Yeah. What you think about the battle, man? Over to you. I'm, I'm, I'm not, I'm not. I'm not not excited about this battle, mm -hmm. but I'm I'm also not that excited about this battle. Um, these two specifically are in the realm for me of battlers who I know is cooking and they be cooking, but I, I be lost when they be talking. I'm just I, that's just me. That's, that's that's just me. I just be a little lost. You know what I'm saying? Ice is a soothsayer. You know what I'm saying? He give you the riddle. But you got to go catch that, John. It, it, it's going to take me a minute. Show off raps like he's off. Like, he gave you a punch inside of the punch, but the whole punch was a punch while he was punching the punch. I be like, that's that's too intricate for me. I'm just saying. Like, but for both of them to battle, this ain't even a style clash. I'm just going to be looking at this battle like, I, I think I got it. I, I think I got something. You know what I'm saying? That's just how I feel. I just They both speak in code, if you ask me. Yeah. Uh, this, this is cool. uh, uh, it ain't for me, but anyway, here's the deal. Uh, I seen Show Off's last performance versus Chef Trey. It was a pretty amazing battle. I was actually disappointed. I went through my channel and I seen it. I didn't recap it. I was like, damn, but it was three months ago. It is what it is. Mm -hmm. I loved it. I was literally watching it the other day and I was like, it was a great performance. Um, I just had a battle versus Gabe. I'm, I don't even know where I'm at with that. I seen some. <laughs> I was, I, that just, just wasn't a good look <laughs> right. for either, either party involved. Mm -hmm. um, it was just okay. The battle yeah. was just okay. I'm like halfway through and I'm like, what am I watching here? Mm. Um, historically, you know, I love what Ice is able to do. Obviously, the slow flow is able to hoop. The rim got short to me. Mm. I love a home fries, part of my bag. Mm -hmm. I can say all of these lines, you know what I'm saying? Uh, who gonna stop Ice? I'm stop lights and stop lights, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Mad of them. But what I will say is in that blue room, like, 
I think Ice is going to have to meet the level of competition because Show Off has battled there more than once. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. So he's been in that room. Uh, he's been, he's danced. He's got crazy reaction. But Ice is going to have to bring it to Show Off because Show Off, mind you, if Show Off had a battle with Ice that was a social distance battle mm. and the battle didn't happen, that means he had bars for him. That nigga probably have a fucking round and a half for this nigga already. I mean, and he probably had to update a little something. Yeah. Just update, just spice it up a little bit and half his fucking battle was Three done already. Three spices, that, that does sound it, cool. It, man, listen, <laughs> if, it ain't, if you ain't sneezing, it ain't seasoning. Nah, so you gonna have extra seasoning go. on that hoe and get it right. You know what I'm saying? He gonna make it right. I, um, it's one of them situations where when this battle goes down, I'm not gonna be like, oh, I don't wanna watch this battle. I wanna watch this battle because I wanna see if I'm if I'm right, cause I'm like yo, I be listening, but sometimes I don't be listening, cause like I said, I so old head, he be saying some stuff and I don't catch it, and then he's like, yeah, hey, bro, like you got, you know what I'm saying, you got to do this with this and this, and that's how it's this. And I'm like, I don't. Man, I be listening. I'm to not all reading the closed captions. Be like, who wanna know how your pitch feel? You ever felt? The wind blow by when bullets go through your windshield. Yeah, nigga, all that. Bring it all in. I'm here for all of it. I'm here for all of it. But see, the problem is mm -hmm. for both of them. This is the one problem. Mm -hmm. They both battle on the trenches the week after. I don't know who's booking this shit. I don't know who thought about this, but this could definitely be. If it's not, listen, <laughs> you know what they say. Well, one don't get, mm -hmm. the other one may. Right. So if so, one get the great performance, uh -huh. the other might get some bullshit. You slip These niggas ain't lying to you. I'm sorry, listen, nigga. Listen. These niggas might not even show up what? in this shit. Or if it's a slip or a stumble or a bumble in one, you yeah, might get it. They're gonna be cooking on that. You know what I'm saying? So somebody is gonna get some bad work. Hopefully not, but it's high probability. I mean, it, I, listen, I, it ain't too many. That it ain't do. too many that can do that. And then do that. And then do that. Yes, with no problem. So, so a nigga might. And even the ones that was doing that, they still yeah, couldn't do that. <laughs> so it might, it might be a little, it might be a little crazy. Um, but I still want to see it. I still, I definitely, I, I still want to see it. I definitely still mm -hmm. want to see it. Um, you had uh, a fight last night. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? Um, also, oh, also, Goods and Cal got announced this week. I know we did a. a yeah. A blog about it, but I see them promoting more. You know what I'm saying? They've I've seen Cal promoting recently on Twitter. Mm -hmm. He had posted a video. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Fight video. Mm -hmm. It was like why? Because you know, Goods had got into an altercation. You know what I'm saying? In a battle. Yeah. yeah, yeah. He's using that footage. You know what I'm saying? Like everything is coming back because he called you know. Jim's the racist bull. So yeah. he got into a fight, he posted a clip of that. Yeah. You know, it's just like, it's so crazy how this promotional game goes nowadays. Um, well, let's say it like this. Uh, do you feel like Calico and Goods are incentivized, meaning there's an incentive there, mm -hmm. to outperform or outdo or outpromote what's going on on Summer Man? It's a card that they used to be in on. I don't necessarily think it's incentivized because of Summer Madness. I think it's incentivized because that's what RBE and ARP is known to do. I mean, we've we've known him, uh, we've known RBE to have whole clips on their contract, no freestyle. That's cute. I heard these niggas is not happy that they wasn't on the card and they didn't get offered the money that they want, so they went on the other side. Now they want to show off and make a good show over there. I'm just telling you what I heard. I'm, I'm playing the devil's advocate yeah, by was, saying it's saying in the contract nah, that I gotta yeah. promote so I'ma promote in one in another league's contract. It don't say promote. <laughs> uh, Just um, say it. But no, you. I mean, you see Goods doing promo videos and shit like that. I didn't hear from ARP personally that you know they gotta promote. You know what I'm no. saying? But they're doing it. What I will say this is that <laughs> it's a bit. You can see the difference in a league owner that be highly involved with the process, mm -hmm. and the others who's kind of like hands off, you know what I'm saying? They'll schedule, okay, you got the face off this day, blah, 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 mm -hmm. you'll do your tickets here, fly there, fly there. We'll see you there. With the other party, it's like he's calling you, he's texting you, How's he's on the phone, he's on your shit, he's mm -hmm. making sure that you're actually gonna be prepared. He ain't have, that's why nobody don't show up to these battles unprepared, you know what I'm saying? Like, and motherfuckers ain't showing up without being prepared. This like, thing is Mr. Miyagi over here, but like, keep, going. Keep, keep, keep going, keep it going, keep it going. Man, next battle, man. Uh, <laughs> You saw that? You know, I think it definitely did. I, I, I told you I was like that. Nigga. Mr. Miyagi, I got it. I got it. You be getting a luck. Uh, <laughs> well, I mean, I don't know. I, you say that you say they being they being just a little bit more petty to promote. 
Oh, yeah, man. Like, I want to do better. Goods, bro, Goods barely even promoted with the battle promote, fucking easy. Yeah, Goods don't the promote. Niggas, <laughs> them niggas is promoting more for each other yeah. than they both promoted to eat for easy. You know what I'm saying? Like, they, they literally are both promoting more for this battle between each other than they are for uh, when, they was, uh, when they was battling. Damn. Them. Yeah, you might be right on that. I'm, you, I know. You might be right I, on know. That. I know. I get it. Um, <laughs> what's up with, uh, uh, here's another thing, man. I've been hearing people talking about. This Briz, 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 Briz shit. Do you even want, if you could pick one MC mm -hmm. to come back, mm -hmm. Briz Rothstein or K Shine, mm. let's just do it like that. I don't do and that. we'll talk about, no, we're picking one. <laughs> the Briz shit is getting me tired. Like, I, right. I'm tired of this shit. Okay. Bro, whoa. Uh, I mean, well, I, I mean, for me, obviously, it's K Shine. K Shine. I would rather see K Shine back before I see Briz Rothstein because at least K Shine looks like he wants to battle. Mm -hmm. Like, it, he acts like he wants to battle. Mm -hmm. Briz has been doing this dancing around. I honestly think. Briz wants to, I, I don't know, this is my speculation, but truth be told, Briz did what he needed to do, mm -hmm. and now he's just reaping the benefits of getting into these events, you know, for, I don't know if he's getting it for free, but let me say, I'm sure. typically, when he shows up, his face card will bring him into the event, so I think he did just enough to just become like a super fan, mm -hmm. and I'm not mad at that, if that's where he wants to be, and keep his, you know what I'm saying, if that's what keeps his mental health the way that it is, and things like that, if he don't want to be in the market, but he just want to be around it, let that man live, man, but he, as long as he ain't saying, the answer's K-Shine, yeah. oh, the, the answer shine, yeah. is the, that, that would probably be my answer yeah. too, <laughs> the answer shine, cause I don't want him to be like, the, oh, if, the, if, it was, if I'd have had the ball, I'd have shot that shit nigga, like that's not him, I don't seem like him, <laughs> the answer shine, um, Sean was saying that he's gonna be. He was saying that I, he tweeted yesterday. Uh, not yesterday. He tweeted the other day, and I tweeted back and was like, uh, "You know, we're ready to uh, see you do this again." You know what I'm saying mm -hmm. at a high level because his career didn't get stopped like per se fault of his. It's just conflict between him and URL based off of the money and shit like that. And I mm -hmm. understand. Listen, I understand both sides of the story. If I pay a nigga to do the job for me, I and he don't do the job, <laughs> I want my money. But if I'm the nigga that got paid to do the job, and you had two niggas that didn't show up, listen, I get it. I know. I get it. You know what I'm saying? They should meet somewhere in the middle. Oh, uh, half off for this? Oh, uh, you take an L? Oh, uh, I do one battle, and we move on. But, like I said before, URL's not going to be privy mm -hmm. to doing Shine a favor so he can leave. You know what I'm saying? Like, let's just complete your obligation. So you can leave. No, 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 I ain't doing that. And they, they, it's to the point where these niggas are so petty nowadays that he could come to them with the money. And guess what niggas will say? I don't want yeah. the money. Yeah. I want the battle. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know. And right now, he came with if Sean came. You mean to yeah, tell me they, if Sean came with that bread? He they like, would have said they like, still wanted the battle, bro. <laughs> um, <laughs> they need the, that bread. That's, what I'm that's seven. That's fourteen keys right there. Niggas still <laughs> wanted. Um, moving along. Uh, so like I said, um, the fight. You yeah, the fight. The fight happened last night. What's up, man? Show floor is yours. Hey man. man, I can't get mad, man. Shout out to my niggas that invited me to the fight party. I'm saying salute. SP was definitely in the building. They invited a brother in, and I watched this brother cross the fight. Everybody was asking me who who you got winning, Bud or Spence, and I said, first off, I know way too many niggas from St. Louis and Nebraska to say <laughs> not not Bud Crawford. But I'm glad that he actually was doing what he was supposed to. He was whooping his ass ever since the second round. I think the first round was the only round that was like close. Mm -hmm. Second on, it was all bud. It was all bud. Uh, <laughs> the, the, see, the thing is, right, I like Errol Spence. Like, he's a good fighter and shit like that, you mm -hmm. know what I mean? But, like, his whole fight, his whole game plan was bad, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. Terrence Crawford is probably the best if not one of the best counter punches out here you know yeah. what i'm saying you throw one i throw one you throw one i throw one you catch me you throw one out like and it was, he was off balance all night yeah so it would seem like he's falling forward yeah and when you're falling forward and the dude is just doom and you throw one yep. he dodges it mm -hmm. then boom then you throw one it's like every time he threw a punch crawford either blocked it mm -hmm. hit him it was weaved, it, he wasn't getting nothing yeah. you know what i mean and then yeah. once he got once he got hit in the second round and took him down with that fast jab yep. It was kind of like a, he hit him once, then he hit him again, mm -hmm. and it took him off balance. There wasn't a lot of power in it that knocked him down. Mm -hmm. But after that, what happened was uh, Spence was chasing yeah. the fight he after that because he realized that mm -hmm. I got knocked down. Yeah. So now I have to try to knock him yeah. down. And it took him totally off his fight. And now Crawford knows 
I've knocked you down, mm -hmm. so now you're chasing me for yep. the rest of the night, yep. and all I gotta do is counter everything that you do. I don't even wanna see a rematch. I don't wanna see a rematch. It didn't, rematch it, for what? I didn't, I, well, from the beginning, uh, Spence, did, I don't wanna say he didn't look, he look, I don't wanna say Spence looked shook or anything like that, but to me, even from the beginning on the walkout, mm -hmm. he just didn't look like he had that mentality. Like he didn't, mm -hmm. like he was just like, man, let's just get this shit over with. Like that's how mm -hmm. I felt. He didn't give me, I'm undefeated and I plan on keeping it that way. Right, right, right. You know what I'm saying? Whereas Bud, he ain't had no entourage. He just had Eminem. I mean, that's all you need. You know I mean, I'm saying? I mean, he came so, out with, he came out so with him, Eminem. But that, that, when I looked at Bud, when I looked at Terrence Crawford's face, I'm like, mm -hmm. he looked like he ready to fight. Like. He ready to knock somebody right, out, right, or if anything like that. Whereas Spence, he definitely seemed like he was shook. Another thing that uh, but for points for for Spence though, he let's not act like he went brawling though. Every time he was taking one, mm -hmm. there was one shot where he got caught and on his way down, he, got me he still swung mm -hmm. on butt. Like it felt like. And then, not to mention, because you know that that Bud is such a counter puncher. Okay, well, what happens when you got a counter puncher? What am I going to not try to attack you? Mm. No, I'm gonna. All right, you just gonna sit there all night. All right, well, I gotta rush you. It just, it just seems like that was the game plan. It just wasn't working. Last joke that I got right here at the round like six or seven, mm -hmm. Spence started to look like Martin when he fought Tommy the Hitman Hearns because you know with the fro too, like and his ears were sticking up. Mm -hmm. He looked like I don't know. That's what it looked like, and especially after that chin check jab, oh, it was bad. It, mm. it just, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm glad they stopped the fight in the ninth. Um, I think that, yeah, if if, if it was up to Spence, it would have went all twelve. Right. He, nah, he was not getting. He wasn't gonna make it twelve. He, he was gonna again, stand gonna up make, though. It, no, he wasn't. Gonna, he, was, <laughs> he wasn't gonna make it. It, was, it just was not. It wasn't that kind of party. Um, move back along, back in some battle rap, mm -hmm. from Battle of the Bay X B B O B X mm -hmm. B O B T B O T B B B B B B B B B B A B C's nigga B Battle of the Bay nigga mm -hmm. Grind Time Battle of the Bay Tech. Uh, Daily Slaps presents Grind Time Bay Battle of the Bay X. Uh, you got two day card. Uh, you got a lot of different sponsors on here going down in Oakland mm -hmm. and. Uh, August 12th and 13th. Mm -hmm. My daughter's birthday is August 11th. You won't see me in Oakland. I'm just gonna tell you right now, cause she don't want just a day. She want a weekend. So I'm just telling you right now. You ain't. If you thought, if you thought you was gonna see my kids' birthdays, seriously. And then ain't nobody buy me no ticket to fly out there. So that's that. So let's move on. Uh, day one, you got uh, Carter Deems, Dirtbag Dan, B Magic, Lil Pesci, Big K versus T Rex. You got a two on two with DNA and Charlie Clips versus Dunfinder and Satire. Then you got some other battles on the bottom of that. Then you got Disaster versus Easy to Block Captain. Day two, you got The Source versus Hollow to Dawn, Reed Dollars versus Pass, Frack versus A Ward, Quantum Physics versus Soulcon, Marv One versus Lunacy. They even got Active versus Crit Mac on here from 50 Fifth Street. I ain't never heard of Crit Mac rap a day in my rap, fucking rap, life. One time. So I'm just going to leave that there. Uh. Uh, and I heard the disaster versus easy is like 90 second rounds. It's like some 106 and yes. Park shit. They yeah, freestyle rounds. the whole round. Mm -hmm. uh, it, looked, it was probably a three round battle that got broken down into a one. No, one round that got broken into three. Mm -hmm. uh, what you, uh, what you think about it? It was either it was either one round five minutes or three rounds minute and a half. And it was like mm, okay. Well, let's not spend 20 minutes talking about the one the three minute battle. Yeah. What you think about it, man? I, I'm, I'm gonna go with easy on this one. I'm still gonna go easy. Uh, to me, disaster is at that point where he doesn't really have to win or lose mm -hmm. as long as he just puts on. Mm -hmm. um, and typically, disaster ain't really been that scary. Whereas easy still has a point to prove. He ha he's still legend hunting. Mm -hmm. And this is just another notch on the belt. I think. Uh, if I looked on my uh, my battle rap bingo card mm -hmm. in January, I did not think that I would have easy to block captain losing to disaster. Or I'm just saying. I'm just saying. You see, I got my Oakland shit on too, right? And that that just happened. No, it's Las Vegas. My bad. It used to be Oakland. I don't know. Whatever. <laughs> so. Uh, I didn't have that on my battle rap bingo cards, no. uh, so I'm gonna keep it off my battle rap bingo cards. I still got easy taking that one. For if sure. disaster's gonna beat him, it has to happen. And the reason why, and there's only one reason why, right? Fuck all of the this happened, rumor, rumor. Mm -hmm. Fuck all that. When it comes to the digestible styles that battle rap fans have acquired and like to see right now, 
Easy has it. Mm -hmm. I had never seen a fiend rebound off the glass. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? The, the ground cinnamon and all that other shit that he did, bro. Mm -hmm. Diz don't have enough moments to meet right now to beat somebody of a caliber of Easy the Black Captain. Because mm -hmm. you know for one thing, he's going to have moments. That's what Easy the Black Captain does. That's yeah. how he built his name. Mm -hmm. You you bring it that hard cover, you bring my hard cover, you bring that paper back. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. You know when the coach start body at the body, when the coach start shape shape shit, shit. them moments mm -hmm. ain't left, is mm -hmm. what I'm saying. Mm -hmm. Big moments win big battles. Mm -hmm. I like this. If he could find an oh, cause this is a phenomenal angle too, you know what I'm saying? He can angle, he can go with all of these mythical flows, rip it, like he can do that, you know what I'm saying? Critical, pitiful, middle individual. I get that. Mm -hmm. But you gotta bottle that shit up in two minute rounds. Matter of fact, one minute, 30 second rounds, and it's that might work. That's his favorite. I'm sorry. Nope. Alright, so Hollow the Don versus Thesaurus. Uh, Thesaurus is, I think the last time I saw him was versus Holmesy the God. And that was uh, on URL. Sure. And that was on URL. Mm -hmm. I did that Holmesy the God winning. Yep. Uh, Hollow the Don, this is probably, this is another case of the last battle, the more di digestible style mm -hmm. right now. While Thesaurus does have moments every now and then, when I seen him versus Holmesy, he let you try to adjust and get back into the swing of things. I got hollow down with the two one. I ain't gonna try this. I got hollow one and two one as well. Um, there's too many factors against the source right now. Even though it is grind time, you know, this is another second home for the source. The source is a godfather of battle rap. If he ain't one of them ones, he is probably one of the cavemen of battle rap. Mm -hmm. But with all of that being said, he just never to me. He never had that Im much of an impact in a battle to make me go, wow, the source is scary. Mm -hmm. Not especially not against the Hollow the Don. Come on now, it's one of my goals. Two uh, one Hollow. Yeah. Uh, there's a couple other battles on there, like Reed Dollars versus Pass. Nobody's being passed in Oakland, forget about it. 3-0 pass. I don't even know why you battle him there. I would have had to battle that nigga in fucking uh, and El Segundo, goddamn, uh, fucking, uh, been down in goddamn, uh, LA somewhere. I would have had to battle that nigga out in goddamn, uh, Anaheim. I would have not battled him in Oakland. Battling pass in Oakland is not a good thing. So I'm gonna go with a pass over read. You got um, an Oakland jersey in them too. So yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, 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 <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I got I, 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 Town I, business, man. I, Town I, fucking business. As much as a battle rap analyst I am, I can agree with you. I can see past one in this battle with no problem. But I got my Philly hat on for a reason. This nigga's biased the motherfucker. I gotta be. Gotta be. Don't you yell out I'm from the Bronx? I'm from the Bronx. I would pick, I would say somebody from the Bronx is gonna lose. I don't know. I don't know. This thing that I don't know. I felt like Reed was the most palatable versus Easy. Reed was definitely on. He he ain't been on that. I feel like Reed has gotten better. Do Is I think he beating he pass in Oakland? No. All right, then. <laughs> Philly all day though. You know what I'm saying? Uh, Philly all day. Yeah. Shout out to Philly. <laughs> uh, Big K and T Rex. I don't even. I haven't heard none of them say anything about this battle. So. I, I don't think I've heard Rex say anything about. I mean, I seen a little video on Hip Hop Is Real, but I haven't really seen anything since then. And I don't know if Big K. I seen them go back and forth where they were talking about gang banging at 35 or some shit like that. But other than that, I haven't really saw anything. Uh, I got nothing. Another card you got uh, Tay Rock's Fair Ones. Mm -hmm. He's got uh, himself versus Real Deal, Lady Caution versus Shea Rack, JC versus Caswell. He's got a Jack Boy Main versus Top Floor Luke. He's got an Emerson Kennedy versus Excel. He's got a, you know, a couple more battles on there too. A Snake Eyes versus News, a JC versus someone named Caswell. Looks like a pretty good card going down August 5th. It looks like it's gonna be on Caffeine, Takeover Battle League. Uh, let's just make it simple. What you got with Tay Rock versus Real Deal? Mm. Mm. I'm gonna go with Tay Rock. Because Tay Rock is the the, the, the the bar heavy one, but do not sleep on Real Deal. Do not sleep on Real Deal. And if you've been sleeping on Real Deal, that's your fault. Real Deal can wrap his behind on. And he's a really, really, really good angler. Mm -hmm. Like, so just, just I'm going to go with Rock as the safe bet, but I would not be surprised if Real Deal sneaks off. Rock has been in, like, I don't know what kind of bag he's been in recently because he battles, like, every couple weeks. Like, yeah. he just had a battle with Cuban that it hasn't even been released yet. And now he's battling against uh, Real Deal. Mm -hmm. Then a couple weeks later, he's got Summer Madness. When you start rapping like that, the nigga got to battle every week. He uh, he's on a run. He's been battling, like, every week. But what I will say about uh, Tay Rock, you know, 
I seen a battle against Jay Soldier. I just watched him battle. Yep. I don't even know who this nigga is. I ain't never even seen him before. This nigga battle against the nigga Jay Soldier. He tells the nigga, uh, if I beat down on one foot, is this a toy soldier? Like, what's wrong with this nigga? Why is he battling against all? But you know what? He's been killing everybody. He yeah. hasn't really been losing a lot of battles. He either, goes, so I'm not saying he's got Av coming up after that. He's got a real deal. And it just seems like at this point in time, what are you gonna do with him? You know what I'm saying? Right. Like he he he's he's an alien. Not speaking of the alien, which is Rum Nitty. So uh Who's a, not a on good anything. a good segue to that. No, Rum Nitty versus Jazz the rapper. See, this is what that's I this is, yeah yeah. Right, that's a whole and that, then we I'm got so many battles. Then you got. The damn, uh, what's that shit? Uh, that's, Riot that's Battle Riot, League. We gonna get to that. They <laughs> got battles too. They got Coffee Grabbers, Ichi Gaia. They got Jazz the Rapper versus Rum Nitty. Mm. I guess we can speak about them. It seems like, nigga, we just gonna be- Yo, we gonna, gonna, gonna be about, we gonna be watching battles. Battle ever. <laughs> uh, I'll start with Jazz the Rapper versus Rum Nitty. Uh, Jazz the Rapper is uh, super relatable. A lot of people feel her flows, feel the way she's able to break down bars, and uh, she's been having a pretty good year so far. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? She had the low soul in the one round joint, she's continuing to move on. Mm -hmm. But she's battling Rum Nitty, who Rum Nitty, he's just like, yo, this nigga Rum Nitty, I seen Rum Nitty some of his battles, because he be having a lot of joints, you know what I'm saying? Like, he be having some side missions. He had right. uh, yo. a battle. For real, this nigga be having some no, that, You said that right. Like, like, he had a fuck? side mission. How is this nigga? <laughs> why is he on this car? Who is he? The nigga battled Dre Dennis yesterday. I swear to God, Hell he yeah. battled Dre Dennis yesterday. Yes, he did. So the nigga be having mad side missions and shit. I don't know. Young Grizz. He battled Young Grizz. Alpha. <laughs> like, what the hell is going on? This nigga's battling everybody. He's so everybody. he's doing a bunch of side missions and he's letting his ass rap on. Uh, I swear to God, man. I, I, I'll be seeing some of these shits pop up. I'll be like, well, press play. Fuck. Yeah, just go ahead. Watch. And he's, he's wild. Um, <laughs> so, he's got Jazz the Rapper coming up. Mm. Uh, at this point in my life, I could pick. I can't pick Rummy to lose any battle. Like, mm -hmm. how could I go into a battle like he's going to lose? You know what I'm saying? And then he starts saying... Uh, but it's Jazz. Man, it's, it's Jazz, though. Like, it's all right. Jazz. Keep going. Which would... Let's not act like Jazz ain't cooking, no. Let's not act like when Jazz get on stage, she don't be doing that damn thing. Let's not act. You right, she, her name will get flipped a lot by mm -hmm. Nitty. A lot. A lot. I mean, <laughs> rapping-wise, I got Nitty, of course, because mm -hmm. Nitty, Nitty is, is an animal. But mm -hmm. performance, though, you know, Jazz Jazz does have her thing, too. She be, but I think it's going to be a good battle. It, it, it can go 2-1 either way, but, yeah, Nitty, yeah, yeah, Nitty. Mm -hmm. Continue, though, because I was just I was just thinking about it, though. It's jazz, though. This it's nigga give me 20-second answer, and he don't got no more. Hey, what is wrong with this nigga? All right, so here we go. Uh, Rum Nitty, uh, you know, he's been able to, he's able to, 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 to just bar people away, you know what I'm saying? Like, I could just think, let me think of a bar like Nitty, you know what I'm saying? Nigga will be like, uh. Nigga would be like, uh, <laughs> I lift the Desi, split him heavy, steal on Jazz, like Elvis Presley. You know, Jazz, Elvis Presley stole steel, Jazz. Yeah. yeah, so he could keep going. Put the steel out. was fine. Don't steal. I better not hear you say, put the steel on Jazz, like Elvis Presley. You say that shit, you stole it. I'm just fucking with you. But now, he's got so many different. Like, and he's just like, there's very few rappers that the whole construction of everything is yeah. punches, nigga. Yeah. It ain't this no filler. He's a no filler killer. This nigga has no filler. Like, he don't have no filler. He literally just battled Young Grizz. And had a fuck. Oh my God. And when I'm telling you, he said they couldn't save the little boy in the bucket, Ray, Ray Charles. Charles. They lying. couldn't save the oh, young boy in the bucket. bucket. I know what you're talking about. Right. It's, just it's just non stop. It's man. like, all right, it, when he do it though. It's just, it, <laughs> yeah, best believe he dying. A clean sweet, three mm -hmm. beat. I got a cheat sheet riding. Mm -hmm. They say I'm sitting on bars like E.T. E. riding. riding. You know what I'm saying? He's just all, and you're going to get all the smoke. <laughs> take so many punches to crowd scream and get off get the off road. The I couldn't wait for Jazz. They, like, he's just like literally, like, like the nigga, the yeah. nigga will be able to put together a line about anything. You know what I'm saying? Like, like, <laughs> uh, but so, um, mm. Oh my goodness. So mm. so I got Rum Nitty winning that battle. Yeah. Jazz could pull it out, she could pull it out. Uh Coffee Brown versus Geechee Gotti is another interesting battle off the card. Uh Geechee Gotti's got a lot of promoted announced battles right now. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? Like he's got Coffee Brown, mm -hmm. 
Easy to block captain. He's probably gonna be on Summer Madness too. Matter of fact, they need him on Summer they Madness. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where this shit looking? Have you seen them with the, have you seen what them niggas are selling? No, ho, 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 ho. Yo, 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 yo. Have you seen what them niggas are selling up the street? Have you seen them niggas? Yo, have you seen what them niggas are selling up the street? I don't like that shit. Yo, <laughs> you better put him on. He better get on that fucking card. If he ain't on the card, he better be on that motherfucker. He yeah. better be on there. Shit, you seen what them niggas are selling up the street? Hey, they Man, Summer Max what out, what they calling it's, it. It's the gold tops over there. They calling it Summer Max out. That's what they call it. <laughs> I didn't make it up. Who would I be to not say what yeah, I see? Yeah. So yeah, he might be on that shit too. Um, he's got Coffee Brown. And they're very personal, it's gonna be dead. And now, out of all the battles that we might have said yeah. anything about this, this whole be. night, mm -hmm. this might be the most personal one. This, this might and it ain't like Coffee ain't known to get personal, cause she get personal. Especially mm -hmm. if it's somebody that she... I mean, I don't know, but you know what I'm just saying? Man, it could be some pressure. Mm -hmm. be you, no, no, no nigga, you's a bitch. You know what I'm saying? Like, oh. You just got married last year. You gonna tell him, oh no, oh, oh no, oh, oh no. no. Oh, oh. oh man, mm -hmm. oh man, that, 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 that. Ah, uh, I. Who you got winning that, John? Man? Arnetta's coming to that battle. That's not coffee. Yeah, Arnetta's coming to that battle. Yeah. Who you got winning though? I think I'm gonna go with Geechee. It's his house. It's his house. He kind of gotta win. He, he has can. to win. It's his house. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm. I think you kind of got to win. He has you, to. You going you gonna to answer? You going to answer why or you going to let me answer? I'm going to tell you why. Let me tell you, let why. Me, like, I'm gonna tell you why he has to win. Yeah. One is his house. Right. Two, Coffee kind of was on the coattails of Geechee. So, therefore, if it wasn't for Geechee, Coffee wouldn't have been here. It's, it's once again his house. He paid her to be. He got a lot of things and the rebuttals. So, anything personal that would be said from Coffee, mm -hmm. Geechee can rebuttal that. I'm up that yeah, my bad, go ahead. Nah, I just really asked the win because he can't start the second half of his year with a loss to coffee. You know what I'm saying? You got three big battles coming up. You can't start him off with losing, you know what I'm saying? Like, cause the thing is he's approaching a battle with easy. Mm -hmm. So he's gonna take a battle, he's probably gonna have two or three. You can't go into an easy battle losing battles. You wanna go into a battle like that, which is the, gonna be the biggest battle of the year. I don't care what nobody says. Yeah. Um and that's another battle we're gonna talk about after this. Uh you can't go into a battle like that, which is the biggest situation of the year, mm. which is two MCs that were both rising, regardless of how people feel about any, their moves that they made, mm. easy not being on you, or I don't give a fuck about that, honestly, because to be honest with you, um, when it comes to battling, I've, I've always been a proponent to battle where you want, do what you want, because at the end of the day, you're only hot as you are while you're, while you're winning, because mm -hmm. if you ain't winning, they ain't calling, so mm -hmm. it don't even matter, so the league's use artists, Artists use the league. Mm -hmm. Get your money, period. I've been saying for, for as long as I've been here, I've never saw any sense of sitting on the bench and waiting for somebody else to pay you. You can't get you can't get paid on the earth this big. You're worthless, kid. You don't even deserve to live. Get your fucking money because mm -hmm. when you ain't hot, they ain't calling. So he's battling against Gucci guys. It's the biggest individual battle of the year, mm -hmm. no matter what. This is bigger than Ill Will versus Hitman. This is bigger than Murder Move versus Big K. This is bigger than In some Tay Rock versus Av. This is bigger than all of those. There's, there is not a battle. This is this individual battle is as big or as important as Geechee as Easy versus Hitman. It's, it's insane. I mean, Hitman is the biggest name, so I might put that just a little notch. But for the level of importance and for the level of positioning. Easy versus Geechee is right up here. So I'm going to... Um, no disagreement. I'm going to run it like this, right? So I say that to say this. Um, neither can, does, wants to come into a battle facing one another off of a loss. You know what I'm saying? Right. Like, who the fuck wants to do that? You should... Now, so let's say if one wins their battle coming up, because, mm -hmm. you know, this guy... Geechee, this got easy. Yep. easy guy, Geechee. One wins theirs, the other one doesn't. It's like, nigga, you coming off a loss, that face off gonna be horrible. Nigga, you just lost, nigga, you fucking up our promotion. You got here, Geechee, right now. Nigga, you fucking up our promotion. I wanted to take that zero from you, nigga. Mm -hmm. Like, damn, you gonna go lose. I wanted to be the one to beat you. Yeah. Now it don't even mean nothing when I beat you. That's the type of shit Geechee can talk. Mm -hmm. And Easy can flip the, 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 I mean, on the perspective on him. And it's just so many different variables. But I think for a fact that uh, both making it to September 9th or whenever, 16th, 9th, 9th, 16th, 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 my bad. Both making it to because because Geechee got easy got his fucking trenches of it. 
Well, all y'all niggas got cars. Who the fuck is going September, my... three weeks what? in a row. Like, bing, bing, bing. Nigga need a break. Nope. <laughs> I'm tired. Y'all ain't even had yeah. cars yet. You know what? I'm fucking tired. A lot of stuff been going on that ain't been battles, so I'm kind of glad the way that this is happening. Let it be. Let, let it be what it is. You are absolutely right when it comes to Easy versus Geechee being the biggest battle of the year. This whole time I was really kind of contemplating on what battle that is out that could be bigger than that, and I don't see them looking at it that way. Right. No, I don't. I don't see anything getting close because material-wise, both of them are going to be top tier. Mm -hmm. Status-wise, both of them are at the top of their game mm -hmm. when it comes to putting on. Both of them put on. So this battle makes the most sense. Mm -hmm. And I really want to be that front row and center for that. I do. I'm not going to hold you. I know where we going to be, but I know I want to make that happen. The only thing, the only thing that's making this battle more one-sided for me is where it's going to be. Mm -hmm. Narrative where he didn't want, where he didn't rock with Philly. That, you know what I'm saying? Like, no, it's not happening. It's not happening. Battle-wise, it's going to be a great battle. Two one either way, battle-wise. But I don't see easy losing. He, he, he ain't watched. See, I told this nigga, right? Mm. I said, yo, go watch some of Geechee's new shit. He probably ain't watched. He's still thinking about battles that fucking happened. He's still thinking about the murder move shit. I said, yo, go watch the battle that you just had on iBob. I bet you didn't see that shit. I said, just go, go watch some of his recent shit. He's been torching niggas again. Like, I know that he might have had a little bump in the road during his year. You know what I'm saying? Because there was a, whoa, 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 the fuck on. There was one time where this nigga was losing like a couple battles in a row. That jazz shit, uh, Trufo shit, uh, and there was another nigga in there too. Murder Mook shit. He was on a run. He was he was on a run, but the wrong way. You know what I'm saying? But He lost to Calico. It, the nigga lost like four. It was, mm -hmm. He might have had like, I swear, the nigga had like seven battles and yeah. probably lost four or five of them, right? That ain't now though. <laughs> that, I'm telling you. Why, I got a couple for you. You gotta get some, I get this nigga some homework. What? He had the news battle in Philly. It right. was outside. He I did really that. good in that. Mm -hmm. He had Feeble on I battle. He did really good in that. Mm -hmm. I mean, I'm talking about niggas you wouldn't even know if you walked past in the street. But still, mm -hmm. he had some really good performances. Bad news. Bad news. Chris? You know what I'm saying? That's why you need me. I, 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 <laughs> you nigga niggas, I gave nigga 10 value, you need one. You say, uh, you know. I like some of the battles that he's had, but the, the competition is starting to ratchet up. Uh, is he going to be able to do that against a big name? The he biggest the name. The biggest name. The but he's going to be ready. He's going to be ready because I see him promoting. Yeah. I'm not mad. I'm not mad at this battle itself. Uh, it, yeah, for that to just be a shocker and that's the only battle that we know of, that's already meant to be the biggest battle of the year. No, nah, I know another one. It's uh, no. Nah, I, yeah. <laughs> I, I, I was about to look at you like, what you? I can't do that. I can't do that. Oh man, that would. We that gonna would lose our seat in the Illuminati. Uh, <laughs> put the cards in order, man. One, two, three, four. Whatever the summer is, man. You should know them by now. I mean, we ain't been hearing about these shits forever, man. Um, if I were to, if I were to rank it, you are gonna rank. I'm gonna rank it. Based <laughs> yes, by, nigga, you are gonna rank. By main events. You can base it on whatever you want. I'm gonna base it. If I based it by main events, Chrome 23. Because it's easy in, in, in Geechee. It's, it's Chrome 23, easy in Geechee. Okay. That's, the, that's the one that's the most. Mm -hmm. Right underneath that is, is your Hitman, Ill Wills, and your, um, yeah, your Hitman and your Ill Will. Then right underneath that is Hollow mm -hmm. and, and Twerk. And then it could trickle down. So it would be Chrome 23 first, then um, uh, 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 RBE, then URL. And then trenches underneath. I mean, you're absolutely wrong for so many reasons, but you know, I, it's your opinion, and I agree with it. I mean, mm. I don't agree with it, but you know, it's your opinion. Mm. Um, the reason why I say I can't put Chrome 23 at the top, salute so Chrome. Hey, oh, mm. don't take my coat back. Don't take my coat back. Mm. Um, we only got one. <laughs> we only got one battle off the fucking card. Max out gave me four in a row. I got four joints. Bang, 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 bang. And then I got a fifth that I like. You know what I'm saying? The head I just, you know, I like mm -hmm. that shit too. Mm -hmm. So I got five joints. Mm -hmm. Based off of what I know from the Chrome card, mm -hmm. it's not gonna be max out. You know what I'm saying? But it has the biggest individual yeah. battle. Yeah, I'm going main event. I was going whole card. Yeah. It's got the biggest individual battle, but the complexity of all the battles on there probably will not be as big as Max Out. No. But at the same time, like you said, it's got the single best main event. Yeah. Uh, but the, yeah, we're talking about the card. We're talking about the card. The, 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 the whole thing, yes, top the, to bottom? RB's nigga, going to win. Nigga, the... RB's going to win that. Yeah, RB. So, uh, yeah. But 
then you ain't talking about Summer Madness at all? No competitors or what? What is the problem with Summer Madness? Do you have an issue with it? I don't have an issue with Summer Madness, but it just doesn't feel like... It, it don't feel like Summer oh, Madness. It doesn't. Like, it doesn't feel like... The thing is, is... It, what's the prom night? Like, which event feels more like... Like, like the biggest event? Like, the one Max you're out. supposed to... Max it's Max out. out. Like, it's... That's hands down. And I'm thinking about going top to bottom... Card wise, yeah, RBE's gonna win that. I was just going my main event. <laughs> no, I was going. Mm -mm, I'm going my main event. I was like, mm. cause what's gonna put the butt in the seat? You going Are you going buy? Are you going flush your last ticket? Like you gonna spend your last couple dollars for Av and Rock, Hitman and Ill, or Easy vs Geechee? Well, I'm not gonna spend anything. <laughs> Yeah. Most of the leagues are gonna hook us up. Yeah, I mean they're gonna do that. They're gonna let us in the door. I mean, but if I'm thinking of, if I had to, yeah. See, if I was in the game buying motherfucking pay per views and shit like that, I'm only gonna buy one. I'm not buying one every week. I'm sorry. It would have been maxed out. You know what I'm saying? Because yeah. the attention and the hype of the promotional campaign. Because mm. see, the thing is this, right? When battle rap and battle rap events are being promoted. You know, it's all about the anticipation to build up, you know, certain battles being released, certain names being released. Everybody's not going to agree with everything. Right. I'm fine with that. But at the same time, there was certain shit that got announced. Like you told me earlier in the conversation, right? Mm -hmm. uh, Av's biggest battles to potentially have are him versus Averb mm -hmm. and him versus Big K. Two mm -hmm. battles that can't happen because they both battling the RBE. Swamp's battle for Summer Madness was fuck. Mm -hmm. Swamp's battle for Summer Madness was Aver. Mm -hmm. And what did they do? He's over there too. Mm -hmm. So the funny thing is the the antagonist of the situations can't even battle on URL. I mean, it could, but then everyone will sign a fucking deal and no stupid shit like that. So it's like, they the, the names that they really wanted some of these guys to have are battling on another call. Yeah. And, and not only did... He had, a, Verb had a grudge with Ward, mm -hmm. he had a grudge with Swamp, and he has a grudge with Ab. Mm -hmm. This nigga literally looked through and said, all right, no, mm -hmm. I'm good on that, no, I'm good on that, I'll take you over here. Yep. And when I'm done taking you over here, I'll come back over here and get one Do of y'all volume. Mm -hmm. Just to show the control of, mm -hmm. the sheer control of power. Um, and, and that's just the way it goes. But, uh, so uh, is there, is there like, what's your sleepers, man, on any of these cards? Matter of fact, just think of not, you don't have to go like all every single card, but let's go Summer Madness and RBE. Sleeper. What's your sleepers? Uh well for sure for sure one of my sleeper battles is um is gonna be uh uh, uh Mike P and um uh, Rosenberg that's a sleeper mm -hmm. that's a, that's a sleeper um another big sleeper is going to be um DNA and Jerry West mm -hmm. I think that's a sleeper I think, like I said even though Summer Man is not, not might not be on the height of the list when I look at battles and matchups which ones do I believe is Gonna be more two one either way. Those are mine. The, those to me are good sleeper battles. If it's right. two one either way, those are sleeper battles. Yeah, yeah. But yeah, I like that. Yeah, yeah. I like that. I like that. I like that. Yeah. Um. Well, you have. I mean, like I said, it's so many, so 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 many cars that are going on. There's so many happenings in battle rap. You know what I'm saying? That are going on. I seen uh Yoshi G. She was promoting um clips of a uh, of her opponent in the last battle, like looking through her phone. And, shit like that and mm -hmm. scrolling and all of that. Mm -hmm. What do you think about uh, people pulling out their phones in battles? Man? Still unacceptable. Still unacceptable? It's still unacceptable. I mean, you shouldn't be pulling your phone out during the battle. Especially if you are a combatant. And I don't care if so what, I'm looking at my phone and, and that other person's going. No, you should not be looking at your phone at no point in time. This is You had plenty of time to look at your phone up until these 10-15 minutes that you on the stage. Mm -hmm. well, 45, depending on where you at. You know what I'm saying? So makes a lot of sense. Makes so makes a lot of sense. Mm -hmm. And finally, uh, it, I was watching um, a, a, a live by ARP, and he was talking about uh, the battlers and preparation time. You know what I'm saying? Basically saying that you know the the, the reason why the artists that he has or that you know that have been on the cards and shit are not showing up, choking and stumbling, or fucking up their performances is because he's giving them months to prepare. Rather than, you know, some of these cards that pop up. I got the last minute replacement. Mm -hmm. Oh, I got somebody that's able to do, you know what I'm saying? Like, like, do you think that that has something to do as a, and then, then I'll put this to you from your perspective. You know what I'm saying? I'm not just uh, asking from just being awkward. I'm like, yo, as a writer, as somebody who's wrote, 
battled before, had battles, been doing music shit like that. Does the time that you get to do it actually mean more? Or, you know what I'm saying, if you have two months, so you'll be able to do something better than if you have three weeks? Uh, it, it, it really depends on the battler because there are some battlers that work better under pressure. So there are some people that would rather be cramming everything in that last week. Mm -hmm. Is that good? No. Mm -hmm. But the two months time frame, if you space it out right, you can have all three of your rounds done about two two weeks before the event. Only thing you should be doing that last two weeks is just running it down and making sure that it's, it's good. Mm -hmm. So I would, I would vote longer time. Because then there's no excuse. Then I think of other times where somebody had had six, seven months and they still choke. Mm, yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm just saying it's one of them situations where it's like time also may be a factor, but it also could be detrimental to the battle. I wouldn't expect twerk or or DNA or uh, or um, uh, like a like a um, like a JC. Like, if they had longer time, I would expect them to be even more explosive than what they are. Same thing with Geechee and Diddy. Mm. Like, you know what I'm saying? But if you give them if you give them time, it's only going to be worse. Because, mm. yeah. Nitty be coming up with that stuff within two weeks. Yeah, he does. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. and, and full content. Right. And, and bars. So, I don't know. I, I, I'm, I'm all for the, the longer time frame. Okay. And that's why AR ARP is what he does. And not only that, he let them know, and then they'll also, you know, send them a little bit of something, hey, just to guarantee and lock it in. Right, 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 right. Um, and like I said, you know, it's uh, it's with this week in Battle Rap, obviously this is more like this month, because this week is the end of the month, and it took us almost a month to, to, to explain everything that happened last week. week. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> because uh, so many cards, but I will say this, I feel like, um, that battle rap, yeah, you know, there, there'll be certain people that go, oh, battle rap is dead, battle rap is dead. Battle rap ain't dead, it's alive and well. It actually lives on YouTube, you know what I'm saying? There's a lot of battles that are being released on YouTube, and a lot of people are trying to find their way back there, and they ask me all the time. Some people, I'll be running to people, like, why does it matter, man? I'm like, this is why it matters, you know? Having something that you're able to say, this is the link to something I did. This is what, because you know, a lot of these companies, a lot of these labels, a lot of these movies, a lot of these things, they want to know what is your portfolio? What have you done? What links do you have? Mm -hmm. Some of these guys are busting their ass, promoting and performing and doing the best that they can and they not being seen. You know what I'm saying? If motherfucker asks me, oh, Vada, you want to try out for this, man? Send me some work. I can send them the link to my channel and then go to sleep. You see what I'm saying? Because there's gonna be enough there that you're gonna be able to watch this shit for the next three weeks. You know what I'm saying? If you press play on my shit, it's gonna play for three weeks in a row. It will probably play for three I'm weeks. I'm about to say, no, you saw it. We can, all of the videos. Oh, yeah, you can play that shit for probably a month. You yeah. know what I'm saying? So it's like, oh, uh, yeah, right? So that's what I'm saying. Like having relatable content that you can refer to without somebody having to download the app I have. And there's nothing wrong with the app. I do believe in, you know, black businesses and achieving and striving and shit like that, doing all of the fucking shit that people say. But my thing is this. What is the lead in? What is the thing that's going to get them there? Word of mouth? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like just saying, oh, you should have this. Because I don't currently have it. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to be honest. I don't have it. I, I want, something has to make me go back and buy it. Yeah. If it's nothing that's going to make me go back like, oh, shit, I got to see that. This is a social experiment mm -hmm. for me. You know what I'm saying? It was the, <laughs> the Born Legacy. In order for me to watch the Born Legacy for the, for the, for the what is it, 15 hours? It was $5. I think it was only $5 for Born Legacy. Yeah. Because you had to have that. Uh, so, I think I bought the caffeine stream. I think I bought the stream. You just bought the stream? Yeah. <laughs> I'm a one time guy. You know what I'm saying? Hey, look. Hey, hey, hey. What do I do with my extra coins? I come to the club for a lap dance, just give me a lap dance. I don't want the club. Yeah, you know that's I ain't buying, I'm not buying the club. I'm what do I do with the extra coins, by the way? I just want y'all to answer that in the comments. Put that in there. What do I do with the extra coins? Because, you know, you got to buy like 60 coins and the thing is only like 50. So, what do I do with the extra coins? I don't know. Alright, let's <laughs> Save it for the next show. I don't know. I don't know. Um, shout out to all the parents that's out there. Facts. Uh, it's almost over. Uh, mm. Them niggas is going back to school. <laughs> yo, yo, when you said it, I knew what you meant. No, no. So, yo, I got it. Hold on, man. Before we get the fuck out of here, I got an L for all of y'all kids that stay home and ate all y'all shit all summer oh, long. Oh, man. Couldn't have nothing in the refrigerator. You fuck around, go to work, you come back, what you thought was there ain't there no more. I'm there for all of y'all, man. No, this is my favorite one. If I hear these two words one more time, I'm going to flip. What? I'm bored.
Oh my god, mine's just gonna have a snack. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. <laughs> no, nigga, no, you can't. Like, no. no. You need a chance. Yeah. Ain't no deadline on revenge. <laughs> Bitch, I'm a beater. Yo, the last man standing. Hey, we can go body for body.